most social mammals, male humans tend to be more involved in the protection of territory, in the defense of territory, right? So it's, it's likely that that conferred an evolutionary advantage in terms of intimidating predators, okay? Just like that African tribe and its men walking into the, into the lion pride and grabbing a hunk of antelope and walking right out. Why can they do that? Because they're tall. So she's full of shit does confer an evolutionary advantage. There's other, there's more recent evidence of this as well. Uh, men who were tall were more likely to survive war. And this is where, okay, I'm going to get into why it's so depraved, what women want in the dating landscape now. Men who survived World War I and World War II are taller because they survived. So their descendants, the sons of the men who survived World War I and World War II are the tallest human beings in human history as a result of that winnowing pressure of two gigantic wars which established the prosperity that allow avocado toast a millennial woman to co to cogitate to to say oh i don't want to date anyone under six feet i mean that to me is so flipping depraved